It is a long, 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 long time since Odinga was gone. But Odinga is back. Yeah, but Odinga is back. Yo, it's been a long, 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 long time since Odinga was gone. But Odinga is back. It's been a long, 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 long time since Odinga was gone. But Odinga is back. Yeah, man, guys. Welcome again into our reaction video. It's your Dr. Prince Odinga coming live with another injection. Let me take this opportunity, guys, to greet you all. Much greetings, my lovely and organic team Odinga. Finally, Odinga is back to my roots. Odinga is back to where I belong. My people, it's been now like four or five days since I lost my phone. But uh, one thing I really liked is that uh, you've been with me, you've been watching my videos. I really appreciate your support, guys. And uh, I tried what I can to get a new phone by myself. I just bought a new phone and I hope that it's going to work with me, okay? Right. Now, guys, uh, that is a blessing just from God because he really opened doors and he showed me the way like Prince Odinga. Do this and you'll get a new phone. So I have a new phone. You can be able to see Prince Odinga here. You can be able to get injections one on one. You can be able to see the way I'm injecting people live on camera. It is what it is, guys. Let me also take this opportunity to uh, welcome the new members who subscribed without seeing my face. I'm here. It's young, cute, handsome, African man. Yama, that is me here, Prince Odinga. I'm less than 30 years, but uh, I'm almost 20-something years of age. It is what it is, guys. Now, guys, I've got two main topics that I want to deal with. I've got two main victims that I want to inject today. Today being the first day of injection. Today being the first day uh, with this amazing phone that I'm using right now. Guys, let me tell you, injection is going to flow slowly, 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 slowly. You understand the tingle, okay? <laughs> it will be my happiness that if you are new to this YouTube channel, just consider subscribing wherever in this YouTube channel. We do positive reactions. We do expose. We do analyze. We do criticize. We do entertain. Especially we deal with those people who come on YouTube with lies. To tell lies about our beautiful Africa. So this young man is here to stand with the reality. I know some people hate to be told the reality. But Odinga's channel is all about to talk the reality. And we move ahead, ahead, ahead. Now guys, let me just... Play you, play you a clip here of Mad Max Sufuri. As we proceed, let's hear from him. What is he telling a Jamaican uncle? You know very well that Jamaican uncle is in the village. And some days ago, or one day ago, the Queen of Travel traveled back to where he belongs. And remember that the Queen of Travel was the closest friend to Max Sufuri. Now, after the energy, after the injection from Prince Odinga, the, the queen of travel, he had to go back to where he belonged. Now, this Mad Max Sufuri, he wasn't happy to see what we did to queen of travel. Now, he is sending a message to a Jamaican uncle. Because remember that this Max Sufuri he is the leader from the village in Yambohanse. Eh? He is having some powers that he can even talk. He can tell the people like, no, this is what we want to do. This is what we want to do in our village. Eh? This is not the right person. But let me tell you, the right person in the village is the wrong person to Max Sufuri. Now, into another way, Max Sufuri is trying to chase Jamaican uncle from the village. Let's go, guys. So, without hesitation, let me come to Jamaican Anko. Jamaican Anko, I respect you and I respect you so much. This character that you are trying to do, this cold war that you want to fight, this character that you have, like, you want to be so intelligent, To stop the truth from prevailing, prevailing is very, very wrong. You are using your money wrongly. You are using your gifts. We don't care whom you are gifting. 
I don't care. But please use your money wisely. Stop bribing. Stop using the YouTubers. And these YouTubers that are, that are surrounding you, they're just young YouTubers that needs to be directed in a good way. They need to be taught the, moral, the morals, the good morals. Stop stop using these youtubers because of the small money that you give to them these dollars that you give to them now you want to use them to bribe the girls that were given pregnancy so that they can keep quiet so that they should not speak out and the, the truth and the fact is that We've stopped this thing before. You could even realize that we've known it. Let me tell you, Jamaican uncle, before you try doing something, we already know. We already have the information here. So you're trying to use the boys, the YouTubers, that are working with you. Be in your shoes. If these were your children, that has been you been used and let me tell you jamaican uncle the dollars you gave to kitriba caused a lot of mayhem caused a lot of confusion because this young boy had never seen this kind of money you gave him 1000 us dollars cash even although the money went back to the master so that it could come back to him because he was trembling like i how how am i going to catch these 1000 us dollars That money you gave with ribbon camera has cost a lot. The ladies were watching. And I want to tell you that another lady is suffering somewhere just because of Gitriba. And this lady is none than her wife. Her wife is passing through a lot. I'm saying this today. I've never seen say this to any, any, any. Because you are let I'm letting these issues that you are trying to create in our village. If you want to help, yes, help in a good way. You know? But when you're helping... Guys, uh, you've heard by your... That is a message from Mad Max Sufuri. He is sending a warning to our Jamaican uncle. Eh? To our blessed seeing uncle who is in the village what is he trying to say he is telling the people like if jamaican uncle will continue to support the youth from the village if jamaican uncle will continue to donate money to those upcoming youtubers he is going to see fire he is going to see at the war hmm? what we call call law that is a message from Mad Max Sufuri. And remember that he is the leader. Now it's like he is using that advantage to try to threaten Jamaican uncle. Okay? What is the point here? The first thing is that from the look of things, this man is jealousy that Jamaican uncle is supporting people is supporting Timarwa from the village. He really expected uh, this queen of travel when he came in the village in Yabohanse. This guy really expected the queen of travel to donate something for them. To donate something for him. Like GoPros eh, to give him dollars. But guys, let me tell you, things never worked out. Now, he is changing the eh, he is changing to go and attack Jamaican uncle because he is jealous just because Jamaican uncle gave Gitiriba $1,000. What a surprise. What a surprise to him. He never expected Jamaican uncle to do it. And he did. And on top of that, Jamaican uncle has been support, supporting people there. Okay? Now, he is jealous see, to see the good progress from the village. Now, he is using what he can to cut down Jamaican uncle, to silence Jamaican uncle.
That is the message. And let me tell you, Mad Max is Sufuri. Ah, there is nothing like you can start the cold war to Jamaican uncle. You don't have power. Your power is to look for the young girls in the village and take care of them. Your power is to take care of young youths who are being impregnated. Young youths, young boys who they don't have the rights from the village. Okay? I don't know if you can try to get my point. Huh? You are, you, you, your work is not to threaten the visitors who came to explore the beauty of Nyabohanse. You don't have any power to do it. You need to know that. Even the policemen, they don't have power to limit that. This person should not come to this village. This person should not support this voice from the village. They don't have power. But the government of Kenya, let me tell you, if you try the Cold War which you want to try to Jamaica and Uncle, you are the one to remain in, in, a, in a big problem. Why will you remain in a big problem? Even the government, they do see the good things that Jamaican uncle is trying to do in Kenya. Okay? That's what he's, he's doing. So, let your jealousy not kill you through Jamaican uncle. Eh? You need to work by yourself. Talk good to your queen of travel so that he can come next time and bring you gift. When you talk that Jamaican uncle is trying to eh, give boys money or give girls money so that they cannot uh, talk about the pregnancy, I think you are very lying. You are lying. Because you need to know that the last time Jamaican uncle, he was in the village, he did the same thing. He supported boys. He supported even girls who are not YouTubers. Hmm? It's just because of love. So this is not the... The first time you will come and tell the people like because Jamaican uncle came back and he support sponsoring people, you can now tell the people like he is doing it to ensure like uh, this story about pregnancy is going to die. It's not true. We don't want it to die. We want you to take action. Eh? Why will Jamaican uncle want this story to die? Why? You need to tell the people. That like, why do you want Jamaican uncle uh, to to end this story about pregnancy? It is not possible. He's not having that power. Eh? <laughs> Let me tell you. Let me tell you this. What you are trying to do? Pretending that you are smart, that you are smart, smart, smart. You are not smart. You are not smart and will never be smart. These ladies, they have learned their lessons. The same, same dollars. They are the same, same dollars that they cost them this all, you know, problem to happen. So they know. Right now they are very intelligent. When you want to bring them more, take these 100 US dollars, they, they know. I saw the lady speaking out saying that now the man should take the responsibility of the child while he's going back to school. And that is what we want. So the message that I want I'm passing is, is that Jamaican uncle is trying to bribe. He want to attempt Maxi Sufuri. Mad Maxi one. Maxine, Lady Max One, what is wrong with you? Are you really a man? Are you really a man who can stand to other men like Prince Odinga? I don't think I do suspect you because you do gossip a lot. You do gossip a lot and I think even your wife cannot do what you are doing. I don't think. Why am I saying this? First of all, uh, what you are talking, you don't have any evidence. You are telling the people like Jamaican uncle is trying to give this lady some dollars so that the ladies can go silent and you don't have any proof. You don't have any receipt. You don't have any evidence. So that's why I'm calling you, you are a lady. You are a woman. 
The biggest woman from the village is Maxine One. Come ask me why I let you know, guys. Why is she why is she a lady? It's because she goes sip too much. Now, uh, guys, we have got one problem in Kenya that uh when you are smart, when you are smart, like even you are a good politician, you can you can try to uh you can try to challenge the president of Kenya. They do delete you. They do look for the ways that they can silence you. Okay? So it's like they don't want that pe those people who feel yeah, like those people who are smart. Okay? Even you can see the case of this Morara. I don't I, I don't know if you knew the case of about Morara. I don't go to that side. That's what is happening. So this idiot is trying to use that eh, that that bad picture. Like when you are smart, when Jamaican uncle is smart, hmm, because he has said like Jamaican uncle do act like he's a smart guy, but he will never be a smart guy. Now, who is a smart person? Are you a smart person, Max Sufuri? Can you sit in the same table and reason the way Jamaican uncle is, is, is arranging his things? Can you try sit even with the Odinga? You reason the same? I don't think. You can't. And that's why I do tell you that you can never challenge me. You will never challenge me. Your behavior, we see the way it is. We see your behavior itself can show that you are a failure. Indeed, you are a failure. Now, these dollars which you are telling the people like Jamaican uncle is offering it riba. So this lady, they used to watch Gitiriba and they fallen in love with Gitiriba. And that's why they got pregnancy. Let me ask you, between Gitiriba and those guys who watched Gitiriba and they had to go themselves to look for Gitiriba, who is stupid? Who is a fool? Between the girls, according to how you are telling the people, like they used to watch Gitiriba's video by the time Jamaican uncle gifted him the $1,000. And from there, the ladies decided, like, let's now try to go and, uh, and let's eat this money of Gitiriba. Let's go with it the way it is. Who is a fool here into this case? Who is a fool? The ladies, they are stupid. They are stupid just like you. Now you are telling the people, like, now they have opened their eyes. Eh? There is no way they can cheat. Like, they are, not, uh, they are now intelligent. They aren't intelligent. They will still go and look for the money, the other dollars. It is you to create awareness and tell them like, no, yes, this money is good, but this is not the right time for you to go and eat this money of Gitiriba. This is the right time for you to go and study. And after studying, you will come and eat dollars. The dollars will remain to be there. That is it. But who is Maxi Sufuri? Maxi Sufuri is trying to use force to things which can never happen. He's trying to use force, like he wants to silence Jamaica. Uncle, if the young girls from the village who have, you, the girls who are born from the village who don't, who, who, who they are not have, who they are not well mature, you cannot control them. If you cannot take care of or take any action to those people who uh, are trying to destroy our young girls in the village, who are you to silence somebody who is well established, who is well organized like Jamaican uncle? Boss, don't try to fool us. We are not stupid. Don't try that you can intimidate us. Don't try that don't try to, to act like you can intimidate Jamaican uncle. You don't have power. Zero powers like Mad Max Sufuri. Zero powers like Mad Max one. Let's hear from him what he's telling Rocio. Let's hear from him what he's telling Rocio and Ayamaru. They are in Argentina. We expect, that's why I'm calling him my lady. We expected maybe somebody who can tell us more details about Maru and Rocio as according to their plans right now and to their upcoming baby. 
we expected it from Maro, but this woman, this girl Maxine, is trying what he can to bring other gossip here. Let's hear from him, guys. In the meantime, thumbs up the video as we go. Remember that this is Prince Odinga, positive vibes to the world. If you feel like you can bust because I'm injecting, go bust. I won't take care of you. You go bust that. But let the reality be told and let's move together, guys. Let's go. To be born in Argentina, yes. He wants the child to have a passport, a traveling passport, so that when he or she feels like, we don't know if she is he or she, feels like she's going to come to visit the dad back in the village in Yabuhanse. We just come and travel, come here, stay here. If he feels like he wants to go back to his mom, he will go there, stay there for two years, come here, stay here for one year, two years. That's the life that they have chose. That is the agreement that they had. So when you see Maro pretending like he's a top mason back in Argentina that is trying to to build, is trying to clean up the in-laws, his in-laws properties, his in-laws place, just know that he's buying time so that the child can be delivered so immediately the child will be, be delivered you won't see Maru in Argentina that is the only thing that only agreement that they had and that is why you saw Rocio was complaining saying you know I don't want my child to be born in the village I don't want my child to stay back in the village I can't cope up in this village this life of village people thought that Rocio she comes from a very, very rich family. No. The only thing that she wanted, she wanted to Marwa to use his brain that right now we are experiencing we are going to have a child. We are going to have a child. And as my thoughts, as my own, me as Rocio, I won't be staying in the village so why are you wasting time let's go back to argentina you already have subscribers i already have subscribers nothing can be impossible let's go and try to build a place where our child at least will be born will be brought up and that is why you see maro pretending like i'm a top mason i'm doing this i'm doing that crying crying here and there but he knows very well the agreement sealed between him and Rocio. They are not there as wife and husband. They are just there. They have married each other through YouTube. Nothing. Let me tell you, they are just marrying each other through YouTube. They are marrying, you know, the, the people celebrating much is the subscribers. But not the villagers, not the, not the mom, not the dad of Ayamaro, not the siblings, not the village. Back in Argentina, not the in-laws, not what, but the subscribers. They, so, they see it as a big thing, like the subscribers, they should be the one, you know, they should be the one, you know. They're doing it for the subscribers, not, not themselves. Let me tell you today. Rocio and Marwa. Uh, with me as Prince Odinga, I do advice. I do advice in my YouTube channel. When I see like this person, what he's doing or she's doing is not the right thing, I do advise them. And uh, that's why most of the people from the village where I come from, Nyabuhanse, they do hate me. Because I do advise them in a good way. Max Isufuri, I've got one advice for you. And if you fail to work on this, I'll continue to inject you until, until now when I'll add the poison inside to delete you. I'll inject you seriously. You know me, I'm a doctor. Kindly change your content, change your channel to be Maxine Gossiper. Maxine Gossiper's channel. It will work good. Because you are having that spirit of gossiping. You can be a good mother. You who can tell eh, stories, eh, who can gossip with the other ladies in the saloon while they are there sitting, eh, they are sharing the way they were with their husband during the night, the way their husband are doing this and it. You are good in that. That's why I'm telling you that I give you credit in gossiping. Now, don't mix us. 
because we are not here also to gossip we are here to talk the reality we are here to tell the facts so that we can grow our village we are not here to gossip like this and that. no we want to those people who we can grow with in our village so kindly go change your channel to be gossiper maxi sufuri it will work for you or i'll work on you in a tara way now uh, guys you have just heard from this man Huh? He's having the fake plans. Hmm? Like, oh, this is what is happening. And these are the progress to Marwa. This is why Marwa uh, uh, traveled to Argentina. He's giving wrong information. Whereby, even I don't want to give the reasons as to why Marwa is in Argentina. But let me just talk to him. This man, this man, let me, Max Sufuri, where did you marry from? I think you married from within the village. That's why you won't feel that love. That's why you are jealous like, to see that the key, the child of Maro will be able to travel from Africa to Argentina, from Africa to America. So you are just having that jealousy in you. Who told you not to study good so that you can travel? Who told you not to become a good vlogger so that you can travel to abroad countries and your child, your children can also travel and see the beauty of other countries outside Africa? Who told you? And if you feel like it's a good thing, like the child of Marwa can travel to both countries, why can't you also start to vlog? Rather than to sit and give gossip. Why? It is just because you don't have powers to do it. And if you are intelligent enough, why can't you have powers? It's because you are stupid. It is just because you are stupid and you are having jealous, and God has already, already closed the doors for you. This issue about Maro working in Argentina, to most of the men in Africa, those local people like Max Sufuri, they are seeing this like something new, something awkward, like how can a man go and work to his in-laws? It is very possible. It is possible. Why is it written in the Bible that a man should not go and work to uh, his his in-laws. Where is it written? It is not written anywhere. It is good to support his parents in that side. Who are you to tell the people like uh, the people who are really enjoying uh, the fruits of Rocio and Maro's marriage is, is, is the subscribers and not the parents? Are you the parents? Are you Ayamaro's parents? Are you Rocio's parents? Shut up your mouth. You know nothing. Big gossiper. A lady. L lady Maxi Sufuri. <laughs> Attention, guys. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Is the injection okay? That's how it is. This man needs to watch himself. That you are a, you are a reactor. Which reactor? Reactor. Which reactor? Even... I don't think if if yeah we know there are those uh, uh, negative reactors but I don't think like they gossip the way you gossip at least let them bring some points then you can say no this one is not but this is a big gossiper full of jealous of maro hmm? feel proud of your family and move on with your fa own family <laughs> That's how it is, guys. One on one, Prince Odinga coming live from Africa, East Africa, Kenya. Today is on a Saturday. Today is a weekend. Let me also appreciate you guys. Huh? Let me appreciate all the people who are standing with me. No matter what the situation, no matter what you are with me. Huh? Lazy gangs, they attacked me like, oh, Prince Odinga is activating donation. Prince Odinga is activating donation to purchase a phone. Yo, I never activated. I just wanted to let people know that I don't have a phone. That's why I went missing for not using the live live camera like this. That's why I wanted to tell them because I love you guys. And I really worked hard. And I got a new phone. And we are here to enjoy together. Fourth guy, bigger. Mama Judy Moyo, bigger. Mama Judith Hunter, bigger. Mama, all mothers. 
Eh? All fathers, all sisters. I've got a sister from also from uh, Canada. It's called Rose Green. Hey, hey, big up. So the thing is that Prince Odinga, I just love you guys. I love you and I respect you. Let God be with us all. And we will grow together. We will advise each other. Like to this video, I expect you to give me some ideas. Key moderators. Key mod if you are a moderator of Prince Odinga and you don't, we don't contact him on, on, you, on WhatsApp, this and that. Look on me. So that we can plan this journey together. You can share your ideas. You can give me some ideas. Because I need a lot to grow. Hmm? You advise me or Dinga, do this. If you bring your ideas, even of camera. We don't want people to know what we are planning. Let's do things of camera. Instagram, I'm there. Let's interact, guys. Hmm? Because I really want this journey to go far. That's why I'm here. With my birds. Bless. Sing, full of this channel is a blessing. Bolinga na linga kio nzele mama motema bakala kite na mituni nzolombo kawangi mikolo mi balinga la kamwa na sala nyoso mo na zua yo 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 na lingi ba ye baso kiko ingana. Na lingi ba ye baba susu basa la suwa. Sele mote manangai wa abolingo. Ebongi yo deside amongo tinyo wana. Nzele. Bankala nyake soma kamboka seka. Soki yo nabiti kambo. Uwe! You know, you know, I used to see love movies, those were those him Indian movies. Those people they come on you, they like they, they laugh now. They, they I don't know how to do it. They they, they, they do now a, a lady is doing to the husband. Like you feel like hey, this love will kill people. This love will kill people. Now you do that. Baby, I love you. Even me, I love the birds. I love my viewers. I love my subscribers. I love everybody who's going to watch this video. Even those silent viewers, pick up, say something, say hi even to the comment section. Let's see, no, man. May God bless you guys until next time. This is Prince Odinga coming live one on one from Africa, East Africa, Kenya, in the village. See you next time.